morning welcome to another new york city vlog so today i kind of need to do a bit of a reset like i need to do so much laundry and i have an online class now we're gonna go to the yoga studio i you normally do like an earlier hot yoga class on wednesday mornings but i woke up today and my morning pee was piss yellow like more yellow than this like it was very 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 gross. Is that TMI? If you're new here, my name is Nika. Make sure you subscribe. My goal is to get to 1,000 subscribers by the end of the year, and we are so, so close. I'm at about 672 at the time of recording this, and I'll pop the amount of subscribers I have at the time of editing this on the screen here. Ah, uh, I feel like my voice is still kind of mirror because I'm sleeping, but okay. I'm starting to ramble. Let's go to the yoga studio. Oh, wait, sorry, I also forgot to mention <laughs> I'm a graduate student in New York City studying psychology at Columbia University and I am also a yoga instructor. So if you like health, wellness, mental health stuff, that's what I'm all about. So you should definitely subscribe in that case. All right, let's go to the studio. <laughs> My online class starts in exactly two minutes. So uh, I guess showering, grocery haul, it's all gonna have to be done a little, a little later. Later. Quite literally exhausted from class, which is weird because I didn't do anything but sit down and stare at a computer for four hours. <laughs> but I'm tired. I've been eating some like chips and guac, and I'm. I honestly wanted to take you guys out and do something fun today, but it just looks like it's gonna storm again in New York City, which is so funny because I think in my last vlog it like rained a lot too, and I'm just like, I don't know what to do. It's the weather, but I guess. Since it's gonna rain, I'll probably just like stay in. I kinda wanna take a nap. My boss canceled our weekly meeting, so I have nothing else to do today but sleep, nap, laundry. And then maybe I also want to film a bedroom update. I wanna change my sheets, and I got these new sheets from Shein, but actually, that's gonna be a different video, and you're gonna have to watch it if you wanna see it. Let's do a little Trader Joe's haul. Absolutely pouring. 
that maybe I will turn this vlog into a what I spend in New York City over a couple of days vlog. Absolutely obsessed with Trader Joe's flowers because they can honestly just last so much longer than Whole Foods flowers. Plus, Trader Joe's gives you like little plant food. So it helps them last longer than the other flowers. This poor guy was already ripped. Poor baby. I'm like, maybe I'll still try to stick you in there. <laughs> maybe I should make them all a little shorter because they seem a little sparse. I did spend $54.89, but yeah. Look at how pretty my roses look. Ah! I've also been a fan of like the shorter vases and the shorter flowers just because I realized when I have the vase too tall, like it's hard to have conversations with people. This, it's like nice, it's short, you can see right over it and they still look just, oh, so cute. Ah, I really do just feel like I'd be rambling on here. Why? Why is my laundry basket like this? <laughs> charging another battery which is so unlike me so I had to wait for the battery to charge I think I was just exhausted for all from all of the housekeeping like the laundry the putting together the dresser the changing my sheets and I ended up just like falling asleep on my couch <laughs> it also was like raining on and off in New York City so like the sky would clear up it'd be so beautiful I'd be like oh my god let's go outside and then literally the next hour it would just start downpouring so i ended up just staying here um so there was no skincare routine last night <laughs> i literally woke up with the couch at midnight crawled into my bed and just passed out but i love my new sheets from brooklyn and they're actually really nice i'm obsessed and today i don't think i've told you guys this so i have a little secret to share <laughs> it's not really a secret but I volunteer at a women's mental health clinic for women who are becoming mothers or are new mothers and need mental health support. So I will be going there today. I'm really excited. I love this outfit. I think it's so cute, but 
I literally work in the nursery and the babies be spitting up on me. So I'll probably put on just like a random t-shirt that I don't really care too much about. So if I get baby gunk on me, I'm fine. Because I hate spending money on lunch when I'm like just working. Especially in this case where I'm not working, I'm volunteering. So I'm like going out and then eating lunch just for shits and gigs. I hate that. So let's make a salad <laughs> and my breakfast. <laughs> I just made so much food <laughs> so I like to make this little like apple salad every week because it's easy and I can put it on top of like oatmeal pancakes yogurt like I like to put like granola on top and like little pecans but then I made my lunch and then I also made um, I don't know what I need what am I talking about Oh, and then <laughs> I also meal prep just like the iceberg lettuce so I can make a salad really easy whenever I want to and the cucumber so I can make like cucumber water or add it to a salad or just snack on cucumbers as a snack. So I feel really good about that. I'm rambling. I'm running late. Let's head into New York City. Target because I want to get some like deep conditioner um, if you're new here I used to have braids in my hair and I took the braids out and now my hair has just been very very dry ever since so hopefully I can get a cute little deep conditioner at Target I kind of also want to get one at Sephora but I just know Sephora is gonna be like twice the price and we're keeping track of what I'm spending so I'm trying to be a little bit more price conscious so I'll see you guys at Target
be working out with like wigs, weaves, anything in my hair. So I'm gonna do that to my workout, and then I think we should go to Sephora after because there was nothing at Target. Like I looked for a conditioner and I didn't see anything. So about to go spend three dollars or whatever. Ugh, Sephora is so expensive, but let's stay positive and let's have a great workout. protectant didn't really need it but I saw it it was a good price and like I just feel like my curl pattern has not been surviving all the heat I've been putting on it so I was like I already have a Briojo heat protectant but I'm like let me just double up so I'll put on like my cream heat protectant and the spray for like double the protection then I also got this little 2% BHA exfoliant from Paula's Choice just because I like to use the little ones on my body so I just got one of those and then what I really went there for was a deep conditioning mask I usually get the pink one or the green one but I went with this one because again my curls have not been doing what I need them to do so I was hoping that this purple one which is their curl charisma line will help just bring my curls back to life. And then I also got this lip gloss free with points. So God bless. We all love a good lip gloss. Grand total, $78 I spent at Sephora. Why? And then from Whole Foods, I just got watermelon and granola. And that was $10. We're in a good place. <laughs> volunteering for like the next class of 
SNBI students, which is the program that I'm currently in and will graduate from next year. That, my friend Samaya is going to meet me on campus. If you watch the vlogs for a while, you know who Samaya is. She's also low-key, like, TikTok famous. Wait, look at how great my tits look. <laughs> okay, so, it's a little dark. Let me move you guys. Over here, maybe. It looks a little better, but I don't know. It's a weird time, because I usually film quite early, and it's not that early anymore. Well, it's 8.42. I'm going to be very late, um, but yeah, <laughs> I really love my outfit, I really love the way my hair turned out, I'm going to head up to Columbia now, I was supposed to be there at 8 o'clock, I'm probably going to get there at like 10 now, but you know, I'm just volunteering, so I don't think it's that big of a deal. Alright, but anyway, let's go to Columbia. Guys, I am not gonna lie, I totally, totally forgot that I was vlogging. <laughs> I had a really great time at the event. I sat on the alumni panel, which is really crazy for me to even think that I'm an alumni of my program. I feel so blessed to be a Columbia University graduate student, and I'm excited to graduate next year, and yeah, God bless. I'm just gonna walk to the grocery store and get like, my favorite instant ramen to make tonight for dinner and then head home. University we just found out today so I may be joining him for a drink or two a bit later and if I do I'll insert a couple of clips but other than that thank you so much for watching today's video my name is Naka make sure you subscribe and I will see you guys next time love you bye